What's up everybody, it's Lester Birch Pink, back with another episode of Pokemon Dreary. So last time we were dropped into this weird reality, this weird alternate timeline thing where there's this dark cloud and it's raining and the cops are acting weird and if you'll recall I was kind of getting my butt kicked in Sylph Co because there is no Pokemon Center but um, I was thinking about it. Um, and I was dumb not to realize before, well, first things first, um, ooh, an item, uh, I'm gonna just slip past the cops here because I cannot afford to get into another battle. Ooh, a revive. Well, I'm just gonna check if I can get to, can I take a rest here? I think that's in... Platinum. But anyway, I was thinking about um, the plot of this. Like, after I recorded the video, I, w I went back to, like, re-record some stuff, and I realized that the cries were from Garatina, Palkia, and Dialga, which indicates that there's been a, a sort of time shift. And I actually went to, um... Uh, I'm... Well, I'm, I'm assuming that what's happening right now is happening in the present, or but I know that this is not any sort of dream sequence or anything. And also, whenever I said Blaine was a bad guy, I didn't realize... I didn't think about... It didn't occur to me that they could it could be the gym leaders meeting. So can I get out here? Yeah. Ooh, this music. Please don't battle me, sir. Yeah, we want to protect his... Yeah, but I would like a place to heal myself. Can I go any further? No. I'm assuming that everything's going to be blocked off by police. But, I was thinking about it, and... No matter how hard they prod me, no matter how hard they try to scare me, no matter how... <sighs> My head. No, 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 this isn't the end. Real black belt. Ah, uh, okay. I should have suspected as such. I was hoping what- I wonder what happens if you black out in this game. Okay, so at least Charmander has full health. Yeah. So we'll see how it fares. Oh, this is not gonna be good. Okay, okay. Please get a burn. Okay, no. So basically what I was thinking was that this has something to do with with something that like Garatina's doing or like Yeah, something's not right in the in the world. I'm actually gonna probably let myself black out here just to see what happens and because honestly I'm not just gonna item stall. Okay. Okay, well, yeah, so I was thinking, and I also saw in in the, dis, um, like, I actually looked at the Pokemon Dreary page. Oh, no. Oh, so it's like, the game just shuts down if you lose. Oh. So you lose, lose. Well, maybe not. Maybe I was just an idiot and didn't have a save file. Oh well. Well, well you know what? We'll, we'll reload our most recent save state. Okay, so now we know what happens. Um. So I'm assuming we just kind of have to heal the Pokemon to the best of our ability. So I'm gonna sneak around these cops. And I'm not exactly sure what I'm supposed to do. I'm supposing I'm, I've got to try to find the card key. So yeah, it'd be a good idea to kind of heal up. It's actually pretty cool, the concept of having no Pokemon Center. Like, none at all. Like, I don't mean, like, the challenge. But, you know, other ROM hacks have probably done it. And as I said, I'm not really, like, a religious ROM hack player. So I couldn't really tell you if this is the case for all ROM hacks. But first, you know what? Let's heal. Let's heal these Pokemon.
So as I was saying earlier before I got so sidetracked, um, what I meant was that I think it's something to do with Dialga, Palkia, and Garatina, maybe a, u a new universe that's been created, maybe by Giovanni or something. I don't know. Because it seems like very cool. I looked at the page and it has like Darkrai and stuff in it too. So that could explain the headaches. Uh, I don't know. We'll just go along with the game. Okay, I'm trying to avoid cops, even though that's probably the way I get through this place, is battling. Sylphco is the worst. You need to leave this place. Okay, I was trying, my man. So yeah, I'm just gonna get a bit of training in. Better not burn me. So that Team Rocket countdown though. I aren't I know I already made a video complaining about it. Oh yeah, I think the AI is smarter in this game. I know I already made a video complaining about it, but I thought I'd bring it up here just for the sake of bringing it up. Because it still is very fresh. Because in the last video I recorded, I was actually talking about it, like, all excited and stuff, and... Well, we saw how that went. And the last video I recorded, I think, was episode 4 of my leaf... Yeah, love that. Of my leaf green randomizer nuzlocke. Moldpix. I would just like a chance to grind or something. The only thing I'm worried about with using my resources is that I'm going to come to a point where it's going to be RNG dependent. Like, if I'm going to run solo on resources, I just need to depend on RNG to help me. And I thought there was a PC somewhere down here, but... I'm trying to remember all the places. I'm trying to remember any place there could be a PC. But I really don't think I'm allowed anywhere else. Hmm. This is tough. I might have to do a jump cut, honestly, because I do not think that this is going to be easy. I wonder if this is like, um... If you don't really have to battle anyone for the card key, or you just have to... Easy does it. I mean, the the key to the top floor. Zinc and Carbos. An Ultra Ball. Cool. Please, sir. Okay. Being real sneaky here. I think I already battled him. Yeah, and this is where I started off. Because then, yeah, Blaine is up here with... Hmm. Well, I am most certainly not gonna battle everybody in this building. See where this takes me. The ninth floor. I just wish there was somebody here that would help me heal. But you know, of course, that'd be way too easy, wouldn't it? <sighs> Those beds can heal tired Pokemon, but we're not tired, we're ready. No, they 
they can't unless I'm doing something wrong. You know, I should have suspected they, that it was going to be another Growlithe. Oof. Okay. Yikes, so uh, this isn't looking good. Okay, so I'm gonna put all my faith into Pikachu. And I mean, I guess... Yeah, I didn't want to switch Pikachu into the Ember. We are currently out of healing items. You know, the whole having no Pokemon Center thing was kind of cool at first, and now I'm just kind of like, Ugh. I guess it just shows how dependent I can be on it, but I just guess I gotta be real careful with these next few, you know, places that I go, just not to run into any cops. Please. Oh, okay. That's fine. I'm Pikachu's pretty light. Now let's hope we- let's go back and recheck those beds, actually, just to see. Well, now we're tired. You know what? I'm tired, too. I'm tired of running around this freaking building. Like, Please. Looks like it's feeling good. That's good. I'm not. I swear, they put that there just to make me angry. Okay. Okay, there we go. There we are. Alright, that's better. That makes me feel better. Makes me feel bad that I used all my healing items. Alright, so we're on floor 9 right now. I think I'm gonna try to go back outside and see what I can do. But I doubt that I'll be able to exit Saffron. Maybe it's the- I need to talk to one of the guards down here. Yeah. You know, I have a feeling... So, I'm assuming that there's gonna be somebody I'm gonna be able to sell those things to or else they wouldn't give it to me. So there is going to be some sort of currency system. I will quit my job so I can be the end. Vermilion <sighs> City, it's empty, vacant. I do like the atmosphere of this game though, it's very cool. Where are you trying to go? There's nothing west of Saffron City. If man in the house won't respond to us, I swear the guy's absolutely insane. Who is this guy? Oh god. <laughs> Trying to loot in the market? No, sir. I love this city. I won't leave. If it's life worth living, it's if it's spent in fear. It's life worth living. It's it's surra it's been surrounded by death. Let's have a good time. I'm always refreshed and ready. I'm glad you are. Pink lover maze. Oh, that's kind of cute, actually. I like that. So this is going to be bulky, I'm assuming, so we're going to just stall it right back. Oh, you know, that was smart. I'll give him that. Um, I... A part of me wants to go into the karate dojo just to get one of the, um, one of the, um, you know, hitmons, but I, I highly doubt that I'm going to be able to hit, hit, I mean, I may be able to beat both of them, but 
I don't think I'm ready to try. <laughs> This clip fairy is more annoying than I thought it would be. Yep. Uh, okay, finally. Don't you love RNG? I swear, like, since I'm getting seriously invested in this game, I think that if there is- that if I do find a grinding spot, I mean in the sense that I can go out into the area, like, the other areas, I think I will be, um, grinding. Because currently, it is very difficult to really take down anything in this game. Whoa! That did not need to do that much damage. Yeah, just calm down. I don't think there's a physical special split in this. Let me see here. I haven't checked. Oops. Oh, there is! Nice! That's- that's cool. I- I didn't notice that before. I love how it's just like, oh crap, can't do anything else. Yeah, and I'm- Oh my gosh! Don't you love that? I mean, I would switch, but here's the thing, is that it's like, I don't- I, Charmander would be kind of useless in the rain, because it can't use Ember. I mean, it could use other attacks and just kind of whittle its health down, but at the same time, it's like, pff, I didn't expect any less. Finally, who's its la who's his last Pokemon? Lickitung, okay. I love I love this dude. Oh. That that's an attack that always hits when you don't want it to. But at least my attack hit too. What else is going on around? Right you know what? I'll just try to get Charmander trained. So what is going on right now? Um, besides the whole Team Rocket invasion disappointment. Um, nothing that I can really think of, actually, which is surprising. I mean, you know... Pokemon Masters is up for a pre-register and like, well, it's up for pre-register pre -register all over the world. And in case you don't know what that means, it just means basically you say, I want to play this game and the App Store notifies you when it does come out. Why? I've used knockoff several, I mean, I've used smokescreen several times on um, but yeah, there's a version available in Singapore right now, a, a preview version. Um, I'm actually pretty excited for it. Um, what's sad though is that we're, we kinda, is that the fandom is more excited for, uh, you know, Pokemon Masters than they are Sword and Shield. I might make a video talking about my opinions on Sword and Shield. This battle is taking way longer than I wanted it to. Yeah, I might make a video talking about my opinions on the whole Sword and Shield National Dex controversy and all, but... <laughs> and 
the game the game does kind of look like an N64 game. There there are certain aspects that are better. I think that I think it's kind of funny though that people that when the initial trailer came out everybody's like praising the water and then they looked at it like during E3 and like complained about it and I was like wait a minute feeling you get when you're truly living life. Trainer, let me heal your Pokemon for you. Wow, thanks. How kind. So, do you have to... So... Apparently the gym is still accessible? It's Sabrina? This is the path I usually take to get through the gym, because it leads you to her if you just stay. Because I remember like trying to avoid trainers. Yeah, this is the path I usually take. It's probably the longest way around, but oh well. Or maybe it's not any way around. Oh, okay, there it is. Um, I'm a save state, because I don't know if this is... There. Because I do not want to lose and get kicked back. I'm not leaving. You can say whatever you... Oh, you're a trainer. Hmm, how nice to see you. Come in here and try to prod me out. All the way to Viridian City. While I have to do a duty to perform as a gym leader, the victim mentality, their minds have been flooded with fear and urgency. I... Bro, leave your gym. But I say to them this. Has running saved anybody from the tragedies occurring all across Kanto? No. They run, yet they still fall sick and die. So why should I listen? Why should we run? I will continue battling trainers until the virus, or whatever it is, decides it's my turn to fall. I love being a gym leader. I won't give it up. I won't listen to them. Um... Now what is this music? I mean, Sabrina's way easier than she's ever been. I don't have any healing items right now, so... That's not good, but it's fine. Mm, I see the strategy here. Alright. I respect that. Let's see what else it does. Okay, ow. Do you mind? Thanks. Um, you know what? I'm just gonna Thundershock it. I wonder if they heal. Probably, because this is... Yeah. What is this music? I mean, it's really pretty and really nice, and I think that it kind of almost fits, like, the sort of plight that Sabrina's feeling right now. I don't know. This is her first Pokemon. We can't even take down a frigging Venonat. Watch her have, like, an Abra or something. Espeon. Ooh, that's looking a little... Ooh, I don't like that. Okay. So I'm assuming this is what we're meant to do. But instead, she's gonna sweep us. Wowie. Ain't this nice? Yeah, let's reload. Okay, um. So, what are we gonna do about this? We can re attempt the battle. 
think that you're supposed to get the gym badge. I'm gonna attempt this a few a few more times. It's just I have no idea where I'm supposed to be going. Yeah, it's a very interesting. So after about 30 minutes of running through Silpco, I've got everybody trained up a little bit, got some more items, so we're good. I already, already did a safe state. They evolved. I mean, I haven't really done anything with Eevee, and that's because I don't really see anything to do with Eevee. I could probably go get one of those Hitmons now, but I'm going to just go ahead and try to beat Sabrina. I think I've beat everyone in Silphco and gotten all the uh, items. I was so happy whenever I figured out the bed the beds could heal you. I was like, oh thank god they can still do that. Let's Oh, yeah, we're... Uh, I've got a good feeling about this. Okay, Espeon. I'm a little worried about this, but... Uh, it's not that bad. Oh, we're both u using accuracy lower lowering attacks. Isn't that funny? I'm gonna sack Eevee off. Rip. I may have lifted if not for the crit, but whatever. We'll try we'll try this with Pikachu. Thunder wave it. Yeah, and it has synchronize, alright. You know, I love how I set up two smoke screens. And I also. I mean, maybe the Inzorka. I mean, Ivy Zork tank one, but. Yeah, Super Potion. You know what? I love that so much. Okay, finally it's doing something. Hopefully this is her ace. But at least the music's really good. It's like whenever you keep getting your butt kicked by, um... 
Primal Dialga, but you come back. It's, uh, that scene from the second movie, I think it was, where it's like, this song, the song has restored my strength. Oh. It's Lugia saying it. Referring to the, um... We love that. Referring to the Melody. Wasn't that the chick's name in that movie too? Melody? You know, I love... I love that it only gets one accuracy drop on me, and it still manage, manages to do stuff like this. So, I don't know if you battle all the gym leaders in this game. Maybe? Thus far we've seen three. This is gonna be a standoff. Um. Mm hmm. Dang, accuracy. It's a lot. But you see what I mean about RNG? It kind of sucks. Like, not the RNG in this game, but just RNG in general. Okay, so Mr. Mime. Oh, actually, fairy type does exist in this game. Um, sadly, I don't have a um, I don't have a poison type move yet. Oh no, this is what we're not gonna do. Oh well, it's setting up its attack, so that's interesting. Yeah, what are you gonna do? Y use leech seed on me? Okay, this is... Okay. So I guess I'm gonna finish this with a Vine Whip? Oh. Well, Ivysaur's defense is like crazy high. Alright, let's see what else. Probably gonna be Kadabra. Yeah. Had that feeling. I don't know if I should set up a smoke screen. Well, let's go for an ember first. Oh. That's pretty awesome. Oh, and that didn't do much. Not at all. I was more worried out. Oh. See, now RNG is like, okay. You've done well. At least it wasn't like an Alakazam. Player defeated leader Sabrina. It was an excellent battle. I'm glad to have shared the experience with you today. You're an admirable trainer. It's a little strange that I've never heard of you. You know, us gym leaders just like to spread the word about on who's... The Marsh Badge makes Pokemon up to level 70 obey you. So, there we go, getting another flashback. Interesting, actually. Won't listen to me, but hear me out. This rain, is it really real? Everybody is in such a hurry to get to the Indigo Plateau that they forgot to stop and take a look at what's going on around them. This rain, maybe you've noticed? The point is, well, why are there no puddles in the ground? Why do our clothes stay dry while standing under the storm cloud? Mm -hmm. Why have the waters of ponds and small lakes not gone mad with the waves of fury? This rain is, is it really real? Is there such a thing as fake rain? Like an illusion? Okay, so... Um, I'm pretty... Okay, so we don't have, We didn't get a gym badge from that, but... That's fine. I just thought there would be like a badge... That it, the point was to go battle all the leaders in this, own, in this unique way, but... Apparently not. So I think that's pretty solid place to wrap things up for right now. Um, you know, my Pokemon are hurt, but you know what? That's cool. Um, so this hack is still pretty cool. Um, I, 
I'm really impressed by it, and I'm actually very interested in the story, so I'm going to keep playing this and posting this every Wednesday. Um, but yeah, we will just have to see what happens next time. Leave like, share, subscribe. You know, it's all cool. Alright, peace out.